some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Well, hello and welcome back to the channel, everybody. In today's video, we find ourselves in Tucson, Arizona with the uh, Joey Surreal camera. And today, he is going to try to, uh, well, try and fail to film inside of the uh, superintendent's office, and he will be locked out after the police are called. Oh, poor little guy. So let's go ahead and sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. I saw a right downtown here, and this building looks pretty cool to me. I would walk by it a couple minutes ago, I don't know. Thank you for joining back in here to Joy Surreal, my old girl with the cam. Let's subscribe now. Pretty nice. Hi, how you doing? Good. I was just watching. I was walking by and I just saw the the, the building inside. It's pretty cool. Yeah. What's your name, ma'am? What's your name? You're recording. Yeah, I'm recording. Oh. Hey, how you this is your name? Um, uh, Where? I find it rather interesting that Joey was able to walk in to the office like this when in my county, in my school district, you wouldn't be able to make it through the front door without an appointment. All the doors have security codes, and unless you are an employee or have an appointment, you're not getting in through the front doors. And the same goes for the uh, schools in the district as well. There's your name. All right, cool. Nice to meet you. Cool. Good day. Hi, how you doing? I'm good. Good? good day. I'm in a good day. I just was walking by and I saw the building through the outside and it looked pretty cool. I just want to take pictures here. Is that, is that okay? Get one, of the, get one of the plants on your way out there in the door. I will. Can I get your name? Take care. Can I get your name? Joy. Joy. Nice to meet you, Joy. Thank you. Okay. Is that restricted going upstairs? Yeah. Yeah? It is. It is? Know. Okay, cool. All right. Um, thank you. Appreciate it, guys. Hey, how you doing, guys? Have a good day. <laughs> Why do you guys keep saying that? You try to kind of get me out of here? <laughs> Y'all keep saying, have a good day, have a good day. <laughs> Friendly and uh, trying to kick me out of the day. Trying to kick me out of the, the building. <laughs> Come on, man. You can't go any, any really where else here. I know they're too nice and they're too professional to say it, but they're just wondering what the hell an unemployed loser like yourself is doing in the building when you have absolutely no purpose for being there whatsoever. All right, ready? All right, have a good day. Have a good day. Have a good day. Have a good day. All righty. Have a good day. got triggered over the camera. Have a good day. Real quick there, guys, I just saw, uh, I don't know, I was walking by, it looked pretty cool to me. This is it. Right? <laughs> have a good day. Have a good day. <laughs> Bye. Have a good day. All right, guys. I thought you said have a good day. You work for the government, right? Nah, I just want to let you know, you are a government employee, correct? I am the county employee. All right, I just want to let you know, I'm not with this, but just so you know, when you're working on the clock and our dime and you use that phone and take pictures and videos, it becomes FOIL. I can FOIL request your whole phone. Yeah, Public well, records. I, I just called the police. And For that's what? Why, that's why I, I need you to leave and I took a picture. Well, I came in here peacefully. Okay. Call the police. Should I, are they coming so I can wait for them? Yep. Oh, I want to FOIA that. I'm going to FOIA that. And, you know, it'll probably just like uh, Denver Metro audits, him waiting around six months and still not getting anything. But in his case, he sent it to the wrong person and ended up blaming everybody but himself. You can wait out there. Okay, I'll wait for them. Okay, well, why'd you guys do that? I just came to take pictures in, in, in this building. No, it's public. For what? Don't, don't tell me it was for me. what? Yeah. Go sit down yeah. over there, please. No, let's stay right here and wait for them. Yeah. Are they coming? Yeah. But don't. This is a public building, man. So is. this is public access. I come here to take the pictures and leave, and I left. I even said good day. Okay. Have a good day. So I'm asking you to leave, and uh, you can wait 
Okay, just because you're asking me, that doesn't mean that I have to leave. I'm going to wait for them outside. I already did what I had to do in here and take pictures of this. That's it. It's a public building. It's a First Amendment right exactly. to take pictures. It's free press. I don't come to antagonize you, and I didn't. Right. And I was very nice, have, was I? Have you do that okay, so what, what did I come in here for that you think I came in here for? You're coming in here to ask for trouble. So, for, uh, so a camera? Uh, a camera is asking for trouble? I'm trying to let you know what. Stop, 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 stop. Stop, stop. I know I'm going to wait outside, but I don't have to listen to you on this. You work for us. You guys are government employees. Oh, they work for you. Yeah, okay. Whatever, Joey. At least they have a job unlike you. You're an unemployed fraudster who's got no education in life, and these two women have significantly more education than you will ever have. As well as jobs. Very good jobs at that. All right. So stop. Thank Relax. It's just a camera. Mm -hmm. That's all it is. Okay. Are you guys hiding something that you don't want to be filmed? No. You guys look suspicious I'm right, right now. Here. I'm right you here. You guys are not complying. You guys are resisting against the camera, against the First Amendment. Not at all. Yeah, you are. No. And you called the cops. I'm going to wait right here. I actually want to have a smoke. Okay. You, remember, I, you're not kicking me out of here. No. I'm leaving because I want to wait for them. I want to smoke my cigarette. But I don't have to leave here. Okay. Wow, Karen's... Look, she's locking the door. She's locking the door. They said they're calling the cops. Yo, Karen's having a good day. You saw how polite I came in there, right? You saw how polite I came in there, right? Huh? No, they called the cops. They locked the door on me. I don't know why. I tried to get them to ask me, to tell me why. I don't know why they called the cops. How many times have you been kicked out of buildings and you still don't know why? And how many public libraries have you been trespassed from in the past month alone? Uh, at least 20 from what I can recall, and you still don't know why, uh, you have got to be a uh, com complete brainless buffoon to uh, not be able to figure that out on your own. What's going on, man? Just doing my thing, recording in public, man. I just walked in there in the little Robbie area. They had a meltdown and they caught the cops, they boot me out. I came in very peacefully because I saw it from the outside. I'm like, yo, this building is cool. Let me just record this real quick. I was very polite to them. They had a meltdown. They locked the door on me. You know I come with no ill will, bro. Let me go talk to you. Thank you, bro. I appreciate it. Lopez and... All right, but yeah, 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 no problem. Yeah, educate man. So what happened, man? Nothing. I walked in here real quick. I, I, was, I saw the building from the outside. I thought it was cool. I went in the, in the public area right here. Yeah. And they had really quiet, I, very peacefully. I don't come here with no ill will, and you know that. And they had a meltdown over the camera, bro. They locked me out of here. Yeah, man, this is a public building. You know, I know what I'm doing. I don't come to antagonize. You know that, bro. You know, so they had a meltdown saying I came in to cause trouble because I'm recording. Nah, man, I don't do that. I come peacefully. You know, it's that First Amendment, bro. My, 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 that's a nice little victim complex you got on you. Let me ask you something, Joey. Is this the same victim complex that has gotten you uh, evicted and booted out and trespassed from just about every library in these county? Because you know what? You don't play the victim too well. You're too much of an idiot. Five minutes later. All right, brother. So, obviously, you know it's a public area there. Yeah, that's uh, all I mean. But they do have where they work yeah. in certain areas you can't go into. Yeah, that have. wasn't my intentions, Lopez. I got you, bro. <laughs> but other than that, I already told him. You, you know, educated him? You want to go in there, record him and all that stuff? Cool. Record the area, the public area. Yeah, that's it. But up the stairs and behind that. Yeah, area, I know that. Don't go back. Bro. I know that. No, I don't do that, all right, bro. Brother? Thank you, brother. Yeah, man. Take I it easy, know. man. Doing your thing. I appreciate it, man. Have a good day. Are you uh, excited about the education session that you just had? You don't seem too excited. Well, just want to let you know that that what recording is not causing trouble. Have a nice day, Sharon's.
All right, guys. Education session by Mr. Lopez. Oh, Officer Lopez. Over there, they seem to to be respectful and um, doing their thing right there. Yeah, and that's one of the reasons why I don't like frauditors, especially this one right here, because a lot of them, like this one, will pour salt in the wound any day of the week. But whatever, I know they wouldn't get away with that kind of thing in uh, my school district, uh, considering that, uh, yeah, all the doors are locked. And if he tried to get in, he would be hauled away in handcuffs, like the scumbag he is. At any rate, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching, and I will see you on the next one.